We're going to take a quick look right now at authorizations relative to a client uh, if we're experiencing problems with scheduling um, because we're seeing error messages we might have to take a look at the authorization to see if we're utilizing it properly in this case we're logged into an employee's account and we are going to take a look at the authorizations for a particular client we would navigate over to the billing module and at that point go to the authorizations tab once there, we're actually logged in for a particular client, but you could always use the search bar to change that up. And we see different in pieces of information here, like codes, valid, uh, valid authorization period, payer, and so on. What we want to do, though, is we want to take a look at how we're filtering out this information. Okay? Um, so, right on the top, it shows that we're looking at it currently in a monthly view but we really want to see the all-time view we don't want to see one month view of the authorization in addition we have to look at it at units versus hours because we do insurance billing by units and not by hours as you can see here in the authorized number of units we're seeing a series of values if we change back to hours we see no values because we're not looking at it for the hours that we work we're looking at it for the units switching back to units we can see that certain items have a frequency of semi-annual um, for that six-month authorization period and certain items have a one-time use uh, unit so that means within that six-month period you can only use that unit one time and if you try to exceed that you'll have an error message you'll kind of be locked out of using that. In this column called pending, we see how many units are scheduled. And in the next column called remaining, we see the balance available of those units. As you can see, for H0364, it is currently overutilized by 1,000% because the one unit that was allowed is actually scheduled for 10 units. Which, with 0365, you can see that 25 units have been scheduled already out of 1,040, leaving 1,015 available. So it's only 2% utilized. That's a normal range since we just started using this authorization. So from this, you can deduce that error message, messages that are being seen in one's schedule uh, might be that the 0364 uh, is being scheduled on a regular basis when it should only be used once for the authorization period.